Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. Today is Friday. TGIF. Do you know what TGIF means? Thank goodness it is Friday. Anyway, we are headed to Walmart because it's Thanksgiving in Canada and I don't have any groceries for Thanksgiving dinner. So I gotta go do that right now. And then we are headed to the barn, clearly. Um, but it's winter, like, whew, I'm so cold. I'm we're wearing- going to the barn today? Yeah, we have to ride five days a week. You don't wanna go today? So I do. Oh, <laughs> I was like, well, if you really I don't- I think my horse is time. Yeah, I want to go see if Storm's in his field. Like, I want to go. Do you want to go? I don't want to go. I know. I kind of don't want to go because it's freezing and I have so much to do. I'm trying to edit a video. It's winter now, Mom. Well, it's actually fall. Okay, yeah, it is fall, but it feels like winter. But anyway, I'm trying to edit a video that I really want to get done. So anyway, let's go to Walmart. We are at the photo lab and we are trying to... See, look at that one. It's going to have a border on the sides. I don't like that at all. All right, we are making our famous chocolate, uh, trifle. chocolate trifle, and we use score chocolate bars. We only need one pack. One pack. We need 16. No, we do not need 16 packs. All right, so this is happening. I get full creative control. My kids are actually super creative. I actually thought of this. And I'm okay. not I'm super like, creative. I said, hey, Kay I said, hey to Kaylee, like, I was like, Hey Kaylee, what if we get these small letters and then put them on boards and make our horse's name? Yeah, they look so good. Troublemaker. He's a troublemaker. And if you think that was my attempt to sing a song, you're right. I'm not very good at that either. I am good at some things, but singing is not one and neither are crafts. Sometimes I have to carry this guy around with me so he doesn't cause trouble. So. Yeah, you Not could. Touch the letters so that I, they, the paint doesn't chip Okay, so this back. is what we ended up with. I think Gabby should cut off that white border. No. I think it would look more natural. Nope. But she likes it big like that. And then the picture that we chose for Stella and Sophie were this was this one. But we can cut it a bit too, Sophie, if you want mm. it to fit. They're going to glue these letters on. And then we're going to mod podge our picture on. And then we're going to hang these on our horse's stalls. So are you using... Mod podge. All right, let's get started. It's cold, like so cold. He knows, he wants to go. Look, he puts his head right over. He's like, take me mama. Good boy, good boy. We're teaching our horses to come to us. with a little piece of a carrot. So I have one for Stella here too. Sex will push the gate open too. If you leave it like that. I love these gates. This is their latch system. So they never fall down. Like at a roll barn, the, the gates fall down. These just stay right up. I love them. Tex gets jealous when Storm goes. <laughs> Storm's a little impatient. He's like, get me out of here. Yeah, Gabby, you got your work cut out for you again. Yeah. No, no, he's going in this one right here. Yeah, so Storm's gonna be going into this paddock right here. And the reason is, is because they haven't been on grass, so they need to transition slowly. They can't just go into a big, huge paddock with a ton of grass. Lost again, going back around Dreaming of a time when I get things right Lost in the shadows of a million stars Shouldn't they invite my near and far? Shouldn't they at all just tell me where you are? Send a prayer if I'm out of Now give her a carrot when she gets here. I don't want Sophie to take food into a paddock. Good girl. 
Somebody said she has a sore in her girth area, so I'm going to check that out. Somebody was saying that she had a cut here in her girth area, and then somebody else said that yes, she does, and she absolutely does not, so that makes me feel better. There are huge spots and small spots okay. that are full of grass. Okay, let's go. Did you see a lot of grass? Oh dear. When I'm in pieces, Yeah, Storm used to be so excited, like, wow, look at my play gym. And now he's like, yeah, whatever. Mommy, Mom, can you get the gate, please? The smaller her butt gets, the bigger the dapples. These pants are really grippy in the saddle. Those pants are really grippy? I know, they're soft pants, really soft pants, and then my grippy saddle. Well, that's good. Wow, I feel like... Stella's saddle finally starting to fit a little better. I see it fitting differently now. She almost looks like a regular horse now. Somebody was saying that they were confused about the dynamics of this place in the comments and it's true, I have not made a video about it yet. Um, specifically, they wanted to know like, do your horses have a stall? And yeah, they actually do have a stall, both of them. Um, they are full indoor outdoor horses. Uh, they're on full indoor outdoor board here. So when it's like really bad weather, they'll be inside and at night they'll be inside. Unless it's like the middle of summer maybe. Um, there are a uh, husband and wife that run this place and they are the only workers and they run the whole entire thing. They actually have an adult daughter as well. She moved away, but she does come back and help sometimes. So yeah, they have a stall, they go in and out, they get their blankets changed, um, all the stuff. The only thing that's different about this barn is that there's not an instructor. So um, everybody just brings their own instructors. But yeah, but it's all, it's exactly the same, full care. I say let's go outside. Yeah, let's do it. And for anybody who is new, just tuning in now, our mayor, Stella, um, has some physical problems that she needs to be treated. But before we can fix her lameness issues, um, she needs to lose weight. So we've been directed by our vet to ride her five days a week. Um, she cannot be lunged because she can't go in circles um, because of her issues. So we need to ride her. We ride her five days a week. Um, Currently her treatment options are that she's had an injection into her hawk and um, she will get an, um, and she will continue to get injections but the, the type of injections will change as she loses weight which is basically why we're riding her five days a week um, is to bring her weight down. When we bought her a couple of months ago she was extremely obese and um, her treatment options are narrowed um, by the fact that she's overweight. So. Um, uh, in order for Stella to get a lot better and to have more comfort, um, she needs to lose weight. So yes, she's um, not exactly, she's not perfect yet, but we are working on it and we're getting there by leaps and bounds, we are getting there. And um, um, she also takes some medication for pain to make sure that she's not suffering. And so yeah, just so you guys all know, um, I just wanted to bring you up to speed with what's happening with Stella. Mom, don't stop. Oh my God. <laughs> Hi guys. A storm just tried to jump a pole. And anyway, he's like, I don't want to. Gabby said that she wants to just do dressage. And Storm's like, I don't want to do dressage. Let's jump. One thing I like about this barn, there are pitchforks in every corner of the barn. So that like everywhere you go is a broom and a pitchfork. So it's so easy to clean up after yourself here. So easy. Good girl. Are you keeping her on a lot in a row in a straight line? Good. Do what Fiona tells you to do. All right, are you staying in here? Okay, Gabby wants to ride outside. Gabby wants to ride outside and Stella wants to stay in. Stella actually does better with no friends. Yeah, see? They're like, hmm, oh my God, you guys, you know what? 
I'm looking at these pigeons and it's reminding me of Levi and I'm falling in love with them. Isn't that crazy? They're so cute. She's doing better. Better at listening. Look at her hair. That's why Gat Sophie wants to cut it. And I'm like, no. Even though it would be even, I like her hair. Door. The reason we scream door is so that we don't startle anybody going in or out, right? Yeah, I had to tell you that 5,000 times yeah. and I still have to tell you that. I know. <laughs> so some people don't do it all the time. Even though you're supposed to do it all the time, some people don't. I just, it's a hard habit for me to get into. Getting to ride outside is like so amazing. I heard that Jessie from our old barn she said the same thing, like she does not want to ride inside right now because she can finally be outside. Let's say I let you call me baby Let's say I let you hold my hand Let's say I let Gabby just gave me her crop and said, I don't need this. He's really happy to be out here. I know I keep saying it, but Storm is really happy here. And I think Stella maybe just churned the corner and is a little happier too. He is super energetic today. I think this arena is even bigger than the other one. Let's say I let you stay, I let you stay for coffee in the morning cause you spent the night right next to me. This is good. This is good for him to get used to this because then when he goes to a show here, like when he does a show here, he'll be really good at it. He'll be conditioned to it. What? When he does a show here, he'll be conditioned to this size arena. He'll get used to running this arena. Good boy. Hi. He's excited to be outside. I don't know why. He just loves riding outside. Yeah, most horses do. Like in the cold. Yeah, like there's some... Uh-oh! Here comes trouble! <laughs> run, run, run. I knew she wouldn't last in there without us. We're late! <laughs> We're late! Sophia and Stella entering the ring, you guys. Sophia it's gonna and happen. And Sophia and Glitz and Glam, girl. Do your part, Joe. Race the car! Oh, Gabby is all excited. Look at Sora went right into the corner, but really. <laughs> but really, he was just wanting to eat the grass. <laughs> That's why he likes to ride outside. <laughs> He's got a lot of cuts and scratches on his poor butt. Yeah, it's really cool. Get moving. Get get trotting. You'll cool. You'll warm up. I love her hair. I love her hair that long. Like I love it, you guys. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, like I'm glad we didn't cut it. Does he need a whip? <laughs> <laughs> this is so amazing, huh? Time I didn't stand a chance. Oh no, oh. I'm not in love, I'm not in love. No.
Even I would like to canter around this ring. It just looks so calm and peaceful, and if you're gonna run into something, there's nothing to run into. I just would love it. I can't tell you how peaceful I feel sitting here watching my kids ride. Seeing them enjoy themselves. See them be in love with their horses. See their horses being happy. Okay, you guys, Gabby wants you to see how Storm canters really nicely. Okay. There you go. Amazing. So what did you do that time? Did you just kiss and but no squeeze? She not used none of her body. She just used words, right? Well, I kind of like forward a bit, but that's what I do. Yeah. So she's she he's been really getting in on learning the words. He has old owner. Yeah. So he did he. <laughs> yeah. He's like deals off when there's grass involved. There she goes. Put your arms way out. Oh, that's amazing. And he just stopped when she asked him to stop. So we need something better to hang this up. So we're gonna have to get like some, Mom. some ties or something. Mom. Um, All right, so I'm gonna have to show no, you hers. Like, like, yeah, but then when they put their hay in, they'll break it. And then close it. So Sophie's gonna have her purple bucket here. And when I walk by, I grab it. Yeah. So that's what she wants to do. She wants to keep her bucket. So when she's walking by over to the cross ties, she can just take it with her. And then there's her little, but she can't leave it there because that's the door. Some people have these little bags that you can zip up. And I like that. Oh, she wants to go in her bed. She knows where her bed is already. That was off. Yeah. Bye, Stella. Oh, Look at I feel like, is that Harlow coming? Uh, I feel like, no, Harlow. oh, I feel like Harlow abandoned her. I feel like Harlow, I feel like Stella's made friends with the other two. You know how nice though, they put sand when it got all muddy. Well, after. Yeah, like after it rained, they put sand. Moved it down. Like yeah, these people. Their friends. She's going to Harlow. Well, the black mare's going to say hi. And now the chestnut. Uh, you guys be nice, my mare. Aww. Too. Like, I hate that. Like we need their mom out there to say you better behave and be nice to all the horses. Like look how tiny Stella looks. Stella looks like a pony. That horse is massive. That horse looks like a moose. Oh, is it because she's on a hill?
Oh, did Harlow just save her? Yes, look at that. Harlow is such a nice horse. But Harlow got chased off. Yeah, but look at it. Harlow went between them. When we got here, Stella was all by herself. Stella! Are you not making